Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's, schizophrenia, depression. It's estimated that roughly one in three EU citizens will be affected by a neurological or psychiatric disease during their lifetime. These statistics are even more worrying because they will worsen as the population ages and life expectancy increases. To improve disease management, we need to rethink our health systems and put more emphasis on scientific collaboration. Brain disorder is a global issue. And so, of course, if we work together within the 28 member states of the European Union uh, and uh, get a lot of access to information and data, that could help uh, uh, to get better knowledge and leading edge knowledge is the key uh, for solving the problem. To better grasp the issue, we need to strengthen the links between the political and the scientific worlds. That's one of the tasks of STOA, the panel for the future of science and technology of the European Parliament, which organises meetings between MEPs and researchers. The brain is made up of more than 100 billion neurons connected by hundreds of thousands of synapses. Understanding how it works is one of humanity's greatest challenges. To help tackle it, the European Union has been financing the Human Brain Project since 2013. It's a project worth more than 1.9 billion euros that seeks to recreate human brain function by computer. 